G'day, Glenn Morris here from the Smart Energy Lab in Henan, China, a island in the South China Sea with this enormous fish farm. And we're here to see SIG Energy's site and stack being deployed on a really difficult site. As you can probably see, it's a very narrow walkway on the side of a building which uh, inside is this huge fish farm with six megawatts of roof mounted PV, a bifacial panel so that the fish are being shaded but gentle amount of light coming through. And the reason for all this capacity for generation is uh, of course cheaper electricity, but also uh, reliability. So they've got a guaranteed five megawatt hours of storage here that they can use into the evening when the sun's gone down. Now, there's another challenge about this site. It's right next to the sea. We're 300 meters from the sea. So the Sygen stack is C5M corrosion resistant. This is a really salty environment. It's also really hot. It's like 30 degrees today. Uh, <laughs> so these battery modules are actively cooled. So on the side of them, there's actually cooling fans as well as the uh, power conversion equipment. Uh, above, we've got their inverters. These are, I think, the 110 kilowatt inverters, but Sygen stack with their um, hybrid, uh, the HYA and HYB for uh, off-grid, go up to 125 kilowatts. So I think the sizes go from 50 all the way to 125 kilowatts. Uh, having 16 inputs and through eight MPPTs gives you a lot of versatility in terms of uh, the module configurations. So a really, really impressive site. And on top of that, they've also got <laughs> a wind farm here. And if I show it to you, that's just a tiny part of the wind farm. Uh, I lost track of how many turbines there are. So there's a lot of renewable energy. So I think Donald Trump was wrong. There is wind. There is windmills <laughs> in China. Yeah, pretty cool, eh? Anyway, uh, it's time I got back on the bus and uh, headed back to the wonderful beachside resort of Sanya, where we've been staying. Check it.